good morning students today due to network problem we are not having live classes that's why i am making this video and uploading this video you see it carefully because this is very important topic and that is going to come in examination every time this type of questions are coming in the examination on random function in the last video also i uploaded the solution how to find the solution of uh, random functions when we have used random functions and one more question i am going to discuss today so this is the question which i have written in the on the board import random <coughs> this is statement will import the random module in our program okay after that we have written print int 20 plus random dot random this random is module and this random is the function which is getting called from random module which is not having argument that means this function will uh, function is going to return floating value between 0.0 to 1.0 Multiplied by five, whatever result will be returned by random function that will be multiplied by five, and then end equal to the space. And the same statement is repeated four times. The question is asking find the suggested output option. We have given four options, and we have to find out that which are the options which are correct according to this question. so how to find that that i am going to tell you explain you also write the least value and highest value that is very important or not only finding the output because this is like objective question but this is not one mark question this is coming in three marks this question is coming in three marks so explanation is required little bit explanation is required and the minimum value and maximum value generated by this function that always you have to mention because separate marking is there on this one least value and highest value one mark is assigned to this one and the remaining two marks are assigned in explanation and finding the correct answer so let us proceed so we have to start from this is the import function this is not going to do anything else other than it will import the random module in our program so that we can access random and rand int function random int function in our program directly theek okay? hai here in print int 20 plus random dot random so this random dot random function this random dot random function this random dot random function is going to return the value between 0.0 to 1.0 between 0.0 to 1.0 that means it will return the value greater than 0 and it will return the value less than 1 that means it can return the value till 0.99 but it will not return 1.0 it can return the value till 0.99 but it will never return 1.0 it will start from 0.0 to 0.99 okay then this value is going to return we will make a table for finding the minimum and maximum value minimum value and maximum value we we'll make two columns and here the value returned by random the value returned by random 
the minimum value expected value returned by random will be 0, 0.0 and the maximum value returned by the random function will be 0.99 it should not be 1.0 it will be 0.99 it should be less than 1.0 okay and if this value is getting returned then the value return from this particular area this one the next one is the next one is increment statement next is random star 5 so if you are going to multiply this 5 with 0 this 5 with 0 this will give you 0 and this 5 with 0.99 then we will get 4.99 any value we will get five into point nine nine then we will get the maximum value we will get is point four nine five point four nine five we will get Four point nine five will get. <coughs> so the maximum value returned by till this one is zero to four point nine five. If the number will increase, the decimal numbers will increase, we'll get up to four point nine 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 but we will never get 5 ok then we are adding 20 in this one so after adding 20 the minimum value will remain 20 plus random function star 5 20 plus random star 5 random star 5 is having minimum value 0 to 20 plus 0 is 20 and then here 20 plus random star 5 here it is giving 4.95 to 24.95 will come here we are taking only two digits after the floating point number but it can be more ok uh, next Next is outside this block int function is there. Int function is there. So int function, what int function is doing? It converts a floating point number into integer. A floating point number into integer. My recording card round. Okay, so this 20 will remain 20 because this is integer. After calling integer, int function will return 20 as the minimum value and it will not do round of only it will take the integer part int function only takes the integer part from the floating point numbers that you have to <coughs> remember so this will take only 24 if we are going to use round function of mathematic math, dot, uh, uh, math module then it will round up this number to 25 but integer int function only takes the integer value from the floating point numbers. So integer value is 
before point only 24 is there so the minimum value is 20 and maximum value is 24 the value return till integer is minimum 20 and maximum 24 that means any value between 20 to 24 can be returned by these functions because the value vary between these two values that means this function can return 20, 21, 22, 23 and 24 these are the probable values in video this is not visible that's why I am writing so the function can return 20, 21, 22, 23 and 24 these are the value which can be returned by the function these are the probable values returned by the function and these are the minimum and maximum value returned by the function this function so second answer of the second part is minimum value 20 and maximum value 24 then now come to the output these are the probable values returned by the function and they are going to the print statement so let us match with the answer when you will get the probable values only you have to match with the answer in the first answer the first number is 20 that is acceptable 22 24 these all are there in the list but 25 is not there in the list 25 is not there in the list okay this cannot be generated by this function integer function so this output cannot be accepted this output cannot be accepted then second one the first output is 22 that is there in the list 23 is also there in the list 24 is also there in the list but here again 25 is there so this second output is also not possible this is not acceptable then the third output here we are having 23 24 23 24 and these all values are there in the list whatever value we are getting from the function so this is acceptable and this one fourth one 21 21 21 this is very much possible so this is also acceptable so the correct answer is is minimum value 20 maximum value 24 and the correct answers will be third and fourth this is the answer and like that you have to solve the question this table you must have to make in the while finding the answer otherwise one mark you will not get in this question only two marks you will get for finding the answer but one mark for this table you will not get I hope you understood if you did not understood you just send me the messages what you did not understood in the next class I will send you the video of solving one more question one or two question next time okay thank you